subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Click the bell button and enjoy the latest uploads from our channel. Hi everyone, we'll see how to write the conference paper using LaTeX. For that, first I have to install this uh, MIC text. Uh, I'll go to this link uh, and download this uh, MIC text file. I want to uh, write the conference paper uh, according to IEEE standards. So I'll go to IEEE conference uh, publication templates. Inside that, uh, we'll get the template uh, in the LaTeX format. So we can download this in the zip file. It is around 700 KB, updated on 2019, October 2019. So I'll download this template and we can go for this A4 sheet, A4 document style also, but I want to write in uh, LaTeX. Okay, so uh, then unzip this file. First I'll install this uh, Mac text. After installing, I'll unzip the template which I, which I downloaded from IEEE uh, site. Okay, I'll change the view. Okay, here we have two file. One is a conference, the second one is IEEE transaction. Uh, I'll open this conference file. I've edited a little bit. Uh, so this is a video to write a conference paper. I have changed here in the title. Uh, before that, uh, we have to use the packages. Uh, these packages we need to write any conference paper. Uh, and my bibliogram, uh, bibliography, uh, the font size, all these are uh, specified. Now the first thing is uh, title. Title of the paper is uh, how to write the conference paper. So I have written that. And author, uh, I I have only two author here. And uh, name of the author I have given Sanskriti and second one is technology. Uh, so you can change the name uh, of the author or if you want to add more than one author, you can simply copy paste this code. And one change is, uh, uh, in our uh, email address, if it, there is an underscore or anywhere, if there is an underscore, uh, then it will give the error. So we need, we have to uh, put the backslash uh, before the underscore, then it is not going to give the error. So this we should remember wherever we need underscore, we need, uh, we need this backslash before this uh, underscore and uh, the double black uh, backslash is to inform that we want to type this in the next line okay the next uh, is uh, abstract so slash begin abstract inside that abstract if i write any abstract it will uh, start with the heading abstract and uh, type the content to whatever i have put inside that begin and end of the abstract next is keyword begin i triple keyword the standard format is given from i triple transaction so it is taking from that because i am importing that uh, in this uh, conference paper so keyword is uh, put in the in the pdf form now okay next uh, section uh, the first chapter name that is i want to give as introduction under that i will give one sentence uh, one paragraph so uh, it is going to give the chapter uh, number uh, indexing automatically so the it is a first chapter for our first section so uh, the name it is a one uh, introduction first section or first chapter is introduction the second section uh, i'll write it as chapter two uh, you can see in the pdf file uh, it is pdf file automatically changing its uh, uh, giving the chapter number okay so you can see here after debugging it yes 
so we uh, we got the chapter number that is 2 okay so we don't have to uh, worry about these things uh, this is about uh, section and uh, the next is a uh, subsection okay we'll try slash subsection uh, subsection uh, um, we'll start with the character like a b c d okay subsection heading i want to give as a subsection one so under that if i put any data so it is coming under that subsection so i'll run this okay we are getting that i'll change the content of that subsection i'll copy from the abstract here uh, almost all the data i have copying from the i mean same data is there it is only to show that uh, how to write the paper uh, okay so this is under subsection and we can um, do the sub subsection also so simply uh, write that the backslash sub uh, subsection so automatically it will index and uh, put under that subsection now here under chapter 2 we have two subsections so the first one is uh, subsection 1 is a the second subsection 2 is b Now I'll create one more chapter, chapter 3. So I am putting this after subsection now automatically because it is a section, it is creating different chapter. Okay. So we don't have to worry about uh, aligning all these things. Okay. Next, uh, we'll see how to write the. Okay. Uh, yeah, uh, if we want the bullets, uh, so for that uh, we have to begin itemize and uh, each uh, data is like items. Okay, so we can see in our after running this code, it is coming like uh, yes. So A is uh, the subsection units, under that we have items. So when we are starting that uh, items, we should start with begin itemize. So each item is like one one uh, bullet. Okay. The next is the equation. So for equation, begin equation. I can write the equation. How to write the equation? We can Google it, or I'll put a separate code, a separate video for this, uh, for different uh, equation. How we can write in the LaTeX. Okay. So. Uh, the number for the equation automatically it will take so if in the code more than if in the paper more than one equation is there automatically it will uh, give the numbers so we don't have to worry about uh, giving numbers for the equation next we want to create the table i'll explain this uh, how the code is working um, wait first okay uh, begin table means uh, we are starting the table uh, the caption is a uh, table table type uh, styles so there's a caption so table means uh, begin table means it will start with table one okay next uh, i want it in the center and uh, tabular is uh, c dash c dash it is like how many columns are there and uh, H line, H line, okay. H line, uh, we can see in the code H uh, slash H line means uh, each line, okay. Horizontal line. Now it is going to put the horizontal line. First horizontal line is there. Next second is uh, text B F means uh, text bold, okay. Text bold. Uh, which are the bold text is a table then uh, multi column that is uh, three columns are added together okay uh, in we are making like a, a merging uh, and merged column we have 
the text that is also in the bold the table column head the next uh, line uh, next column line that is uh, 2 to 4 okay so first one uh, first column line is not there okay uh, that is what i mean horizontal line but uh, that first for the first column the horizontal line is not there that's why we are giving uh, name here c line uh, 2 to 4 next uh, uh, text bf so again uh, i want the bold uh, data that is a uh, head and uh, table uh, column subhead subhead subheads okay so um, these things are like how we can arrange the column i mean table okay uh, next h line means again it will put all the line horizontal line for all the columns so i'll continue this We can uh, copy this uh, uh, content that is uh, copy and more table copy. These things uh, I can keep on adding to make uh, more number of uh, rows. Okay. So end the table, end the center. This is about table. The next is uh, figure. So uh, figure we have uh, H T B P. This is the position of uh, figure. I'll uh, change it to H. Okay. Uh, the center line, the figure, uh, the fig dot png that is there in the same folder. It should be there in the same folder. Then only you, you, you will not get any error, and it will take that uh, figure. And I want the caption that example of figure caption. Okay, label is big. So, okay. So, figure one and the figure one is example of figure caption. Here the we have this figure. Now I changed it from H to B. B stand for bottom. So it came to the bottom of the page. Okay. I am creating a one more section that is for chapter 4. Okay. I will change it to H. So it will come back to the, the original position. Where I have copied this code, it will go to that uh, place only. If I type H, and T stand for top, B stand for bottom okay so uh, this is about the figure equation is done the next uh, okay so uh, Next, I'll put the acknowledgement the section. Acknowledgement, it will uh, okay. okay. Uh, next is uh,
after acknowledgement the bibliography begin bibliography uh, i can specify how many bibliography there in that uh, flower packet if i keep empty i can put how many i want and uh, the code unique code should be given for each uh, papers like uh, bibliography item b1 so b1 stand for for the first paper so uh, first i'll run this code okay so we'll see how it looks done uh, now okay, where is it yeah so uh, biblio uh, it came as like reference the references these are the references and uh, not given any chapter name for that okay that's not required actually according to the ieee standard uh, next i want to put this uh, citation so wherever i want to put the citation we should go for that uh, data content and backslash site okay i'll type here now backslash uh, site okay in the flower bracket b6 stand for uh, the sixth paper okay so here it is going to print like in the square bracket six that is for the citation next i will repeat this uh, for one more paper okay i'll type here so i right click and jump to the source i'll come to know where is that if your paper is very lengthy we can find use this method to find out uh, uh, the position where you want to do this citation site b1 okay so now it is in the pdf updated the citation is given that is uh, one so this is the way you can write the uh, paper conference paper it is very easy please